Litbit channel. Today we will see Two Way Belongs to America by Bharati Mukherjee. Let's we see the summary of this prose. In introduction part, Bharati Mukherjee presents the concept of multiple identities in the immigrants community. This essay presents her personal experience in America and the transformations that America has credited on her. Expatriate versus immigrants. The title is significant to the essay as it is about the two ways of belonging by the migrants in America. One is in expatriate imagining about their home country and the second is as an immigrants accepting the settled land completely. Identical view on socio-political and cultural issue. Bardi along with her sister Mira went to America for education in 1960s. In India they both shared almost identical views on socio-political and cultural issues. They both left India with the decision to return home for marriage after pursuing education in the US. Mira is expatriate. Unexpectedly, Mira married an Indian student in America in 1962 and soon they got labor certificate which is necessity for the green card. Mira continues to live in the US for more than 36 years as a legal immigrant with Indian citizenship. She lived with the hope of returning home after her retirement. Bardi is a immigrant. Bardi married her fellow students who was an American in 1963. By marriage, she opted for fluidity, self-inventions and renounced to caste observation. Her works are based on these themes and thus they are received as an apologist test for cultural and psychological monocularizations. Mira and Bardi stayed close over phone conversation. Through they both have difference of opinion, they maintained a polite conversation probably that was out of pity. Bardi sympathized her sister Mira for her narrow perception and superficial understanding of the American society. Mira pitied Bardi for the consequence of her marriage like ensure of Indianness and unstructured lifestyle. Later, U.S. Vice President Algo Drive, Citizenship USA and the increase of illegal immigration changes the tone of the conversation between the sisters. Mira was upset about the implementation of the new immigration policy forced upon the old settler. She felt that she was manipulated and discarded by the American government. Mira complained that through she invested her knowledge for the development of the American preschool and obeyed all the rules, America imposed its new rules even upon the legal immigrants. Bharati compares Mira's interest to stay in America and at the same time her rejections of American citizenship with loveless marriage but which is comfortable and long lasting. Mira is determined to maintain her Indian identity in spite of her long stay in America and she is very particular about not transforming it. Bardi inquired Mira about her decision. Due to the anti-immigrants bill of congress and her reply was a shock to Bardi. Mira decided to become the USA citizenship but when she feels like returning India. She will change her citizenship to India. In spite of living for several years in the US, still she feels it as a foreign country and she sends a close attachment with India. In a family, two sisters who got exposed to the same kind of environment and situation reacts in different manners with their immigrants experience. One is ready to accept the new culture to move from the expatriate aristocrat to immigrants nobody willingly whereas the other one sticks with the old. Mira like the large number of immigrant communities across the globe attached to their home country. However, there is some considerable difference exit between Mira and those hardworking 
silenced documented immigrants due to her english fluency anchor and confidence bharati too has uh, undergone betrayal by the canadian government some 20 years ago she along with her husband lived in canada and placed in a good job in spite of her uh, superior position in merits and job she was discriminated by the local canadian society the feel of betrayal drove many immigrants out of the country in spite of the disappointed with the settled society bharati feels to be like a part of the community wherever she lives either in canada or in america conclusion of this prose bharati concludes the essay by projecting the difference between mira and herself Mira lives happily as an expatriate Indian with a hope of returning to India then as an American immigrant. On the other hand, Bharati likes to put down her roots in a settled land. She is willing to undergo the trauma of self-transformation in order to become a part of the settled land. This trauma is experienced by the immigrants whereas the expatriate escape from this. இந்த வீடியோ உங்களுக்கு பிரச்சனை தான் இருக்கலாம் லைக் பண்ணுங்கள் ஷேர் பண்ணுங்கள் கமெண்ட் பண்ணுங்கள் சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணி கூட இருக்க பெல் ஐக்